gonna have the same, the same, you gonna have the same blessings and stuff when you come back again too. You know? You may be seeming feeble, y'all. Maybe the youngest speaking brother. This may be a pretty brother. I'll be like, oh, nobody will fight back. Nobody will kill, kill a, a so-called white person, or kill Cain or Abel. That's the reason why, because that mark, that mark, because they're white. That's why people are like, oh, we can't fight it back. Well, that shit's getting lifted, just to let y'all know. That shit is getting lifted. It's going to be lifted. Because he says, who's going to rise Judah up? Who's gonna rise Israel up? In order for Israel to go inside Cain and Abel, or Cain and Esau's ass, which is the same person, that spirit's gonna have to be lifted, where that fire's gonna have to be in them, where it's like, okay, let me start not doing this motherfucker back. Like we said, he said one is gonna chase a hundred, two will chase a thousand. You got that? This ain't no game, man. Y'all believe it's like, oh, spiritual powers don't exist. But, they do. The same thing the government will tell you which you saw is a fucking liar. He'll tell you a person that hears voices is schizophrenic. But he'll put an X Men and say, oh, the person can hear voices is telepathic. Hmm. Same shit, right? Person has dreams and visions, so called psychics, right? But they'll say you're schizophrenic. The person that sees visions in X Men is a what? Fucking, you got psycho kinesis or psycho, got some kind of psych. You see how everything they say has to deal with the mind. It's psycho, something, psycho this, psycho that. That's why it says that, um, as a man thinketh, so shall he be. So when you niggas over here, and you other Israelites, you niggas, and you niggas that listen to bitches, you better stop listening to bitches and stop listening to all these fucking people who tell you what you can and you can't do. Okay? Because uh, they'll tell you. The Illuminati will tell you shit, man. You know, they'll tell you shit. They'll t- the Illuminati will tell you shit, you know. They'll tell you the truth. Drake said it. I prayed for it, then I went and got it. That's in the Bible. Okay? Then, um... Then, um... Will Smith told you the same thing. I won't I allow another man to outwork you. You let that man get in your mind. That's why y'all, Esau is in your fucking mind right now. To be honest, Esau is in your fucking mind. I don't. I didn't even touch this screen, and it's on Uncle Ben shit. So I don't know what the fuck happened. But Esau's in your mind. That's why you weak. That's why the most likely I put that spirit on you, Jake's, which is already happening, to fight back. Hey, okay. it's gonna happen. You know, people are like, are oh, you trying to fight back? Because you is white or black? No. Because a lot of you black motherfuckers will get fucked up too. I'm getting twisted. Just because you look like that, don't mean you come from And just because a person is white, so called white, I mean, he ain't no Israelite, bro. We don't have Israel that's different colors, bro. I keep telling you. Because you might be fighting somebody, and next thing you know, you're going to look over, you're going to have a white Israelite next to you. So called white, because that's what y'all want to call this uh, <laughs> like, oh, I'm in here. Cause this nigga probably having dreams and visions too. You know what I mean? He's like my whole life I knew I was black. It's like, nah. Hey, but for though, it's gonna be like that, man. You gonna have some some Jakes that look good in the meats. You know what I mean? Cambodian. Come on. My root. Come on. You know? They gonna be jumping out the woodwork. So, they over there talking about Kamal Lives Matter, you know, Black Lives Matter. <laughs> you know what I mean? The out there talking about the dang Lives Matter. They better come on with this shit. Well, they, the, the Laos, they probably won't say, 
uh, they probably won't call you, uh, they probably say my collateral. Well, I know my, my mad, I call it mad grandma. I got a loud, I got a lot of grandmas for different races, man. I'll tell you, I'm gonna be dragged. They'll call me Bacala. Or like, if I go to like my Mexican, what about Mexican grandma? They don't call you, they don't call you no, what most people will be calling you like, you know, fucking, uh, what the fuck they call me? Like, uh, What I'm trying to say, I'm so tired and shit. They'll call you like Mordenito, you know, they'll call you nice shit, like, you know what I mean? Like, Mordenito, like, you know, nice little shit. You know what I mean? So, they're gonna call you like La Lua, you know, like, there's different shit, you know what I mean? Because even in Hawaii, man, they talk about, they call, like in Vegas, man, they got a whole bunch of people from the islands, man. They said they call us royal. They say that, hey, no, 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 your people royal. They be like, hey, bro. They be like, hey, bro. Hey, okay. They be like, yo, your people royal where we from, cuz. That's how they talk. They be like, and they were like, let's go eat, let's go grind. You know, they talk like that. They be like, you royal, your people royal. There's an island of your people out there, bro. That's how they talk. They be like, there's an island of people like you from where we from. We can't even go there, bro. They be like, can't even shoot, cuz. <laughs> That's how they talk, man. So you gonna have Jakes of different, man. You gonna have Jakes of different types, and they ride wilding up, man. And Jakes is scrappy, man. That's why, I, that's why I be telling y'all, man. Sometimes you catch that little. We used to catch the little uh, so-called like white boys in the hood. You know what I mean? Back in the day, and you know, you know, I be telling people like, hey, man, that nigga got spirit, bro. Like, he, y'all, y'all think he white? And this nigga, he beating up on you, Jakes, and he a nigga. You know what I mean? You get to sell. Who your father? I don't know. He don't even know his daddy is. Y'all can't be just like, yo, this color, this color. That shit ain't gonna matter. But this whole Esau Jacob thing, this whole Cain and Abel thing, shit, man, this shit coming to you. It's about to be over, man. This shit been, this shit been this way for a minute. You can say the snake in the garden, you know what I mean? It was against Adam. Then Cain was against Abel. The motherfucking Esau against Jacob. This shit don't stop. We still on Esau Jacob. After this, this is done. I don't even want to play this game no more. Fuck this. this like, I know this ain't no game, but you know what I mean? Like, I ain't trying to come back to no life like this. Third and fourth generations and shit. Come back to your Uncle Ben. Tomato basil rice. Nobody want to come back to see that shit. But I digress from what I wanted to say about the Cain and Abel. Like, realistically, like, it's that mark, man. Cain literally hates you, man. They hate you. Cain will act like Esau might even act like he like y'all niggas. This nigga don't like you, bro. So, yeah, judged by the spirit. So, I, I get it when Zabak said, though, one of his videos, HOI brother, he said, uh, he said, uh, he said, just because there's a pile of snakes, and even though there's a pile of snakes and there's only a couple rattlesnakes in there, you don't go jump in there because you know all the rest ain't ain't gonna bite. But that those three might, you know what I mean? I I understand. That's why he says be separate. But you know, at the same time, it's like you try your best to be separate, but it's like you can't. We can't right now. We can't be as I mean, we try to be as separate as possible, but we can't. No matter what you do, people gonna keep coming up to you, trying to be your friend, want to talk to you. And I mean, like I said, be judged by the spirit, just be nice, you ain't. Like, I don't even like, I don't even want no friends. I don't want no brothers, I don't want no family. Nah, I ain't looking for that shit. I ain't, I ain't looking. Everybody want to be my friend, my brother. Like, I'm not looking for that shit, man. I want to get the fuck up out of here. That's it. Because... With friends like y'all, who the fuck me enemies? You know what I mean? Like, if I'm trying to do something and y'all say I can't, I don't need you as no motherfucking friend. I know acquaintance. Like, your friends will give you something. Like, your so-called friends I give you some shit. They'll get your ass in trouble. Or they'll give you some shit that'll get your ass in trouble. Or give you some shit to say it was fixed and it's broken. 
Y'all niggas ain't friends. You don't understand the word friendship. Nigga, friendship is in this word. Friend, the only friends we need is your hot by shooting you outside. If you ain't in this word, we can't be friends. Because how we gonna walk hand in hand? It's like I gotta keep giving up my spirit just to fucking hang out with your stupid ass. I ain't trying to do that. I said, I gotta run. I gotta do the land. Fuck it, actually, let me go. I'll talk to y'all. Give me a second. I gotta kill this damn truck up. Woo, that's, that's the opera right there. That's the opera. People maybe making black jokes and all kinds of shit. Like, no, I, like I can get it. I get it. You know, black people make jokes. Niggas make jokes. I ain't gonna be like, oh, a nigga is racist or hates black people because you make a joke, nigga. Everybody make jokes about each other. You know what I mean? Me and my brothers and sisters talk shit about each other. <laughs> About each other's mama, and we got the same mama. Like, man, nigga, fuck your mom. <laughs> like, that's how we be talking. Like, forget your mom. We got the same dad, you know, but, but your mama don't even love you. You know what I mean? Like, I ain't gonna say, either you, y'all understand that, you know? So, a lot of this shit that you see, a lot of this shit's simple. You got people out there talking about, oh, fucking burn a flag, burn a black person. How about burn a, burn a flag? Burn, burn some gay people. How come y'all don't say shit like that? You're just gonna say burn a black person. Why? Why? That don't even make sense. Tell me why all the truck stops across America, a lot of them have taken down their American flags for these country, for these other people from different countries that come from the so-called Middle East, Arabs and shit like that. But they never got taken in slavery. But the people that got taken in slavery under that flag, which this bitch said some dumbass shit like, oh, you should be burning that flag. We should fucking commit hate crimes on you because we fucking gave you your freedom. Bitch, you also stole us along with the fucking Africans and them Arabs, okay? The Ishmaelites, the Hamites, you fucking stole us. Don't fucking sit up here and be like, oh, we should fucking burn you. You should be happy. No, bitch, we shouldn't be happy. Why the fuck should we be happy? We don't even have our full language. We don't know our customs. We trying to learn that shit. We should be fucking happy over your flag that you created. That wasn't even a flag back then. Didn't even that kept adding stars as you took over colonies. Okay? And we gave you your freedom. If we so free, why the fuck you worried about what we doing? Freedom, bitch. Do you understand the word? It means do what the fuck you want. Okay, freedom. Now we gave you freedom, and we're gonna control your what you do. That ain't fucking freedom, bitch. That sound like punishment. Sound like all right. You sound like what your mom do on Christmas, or on fucking your foster parents would do to me on Christmas. I've been grounded. I live with them for four years, but I'm grounded in my ears. I'm grounded in my room for three years, but on they Christmas because they was Christians, they would let me out just for half the day. But otherwise, get your ass back in that room. I was always grounded. That's what that shit sound like. We are gonna give you a little bit of shit, but you you still can't do shit. Can I hang out with my friends? No. <laughs> it's kind of like on Django when it was like, so he's a free man. Yeah. So should I treat him like a free man? No. So should I treat him like a white man? No. How about fact, let me find that so y'all motherfuckers understand what I'm saying. Let me find that. <sighs> there we go. Perfect. And it's there. 
It's perfect. Django year around your magnificent grounds. Oh, well, absolutely. Uh, Bettina. Yes, sir, Big Dad. Uh, what's your Jimmy's name again? Django. Django. Bettina Sugar, could you take Django there and take him around the grounds here and show him all the pretty stuff? As you please, Big Dad. Oh, Mr. Bennett, I must remind you, Django is a free man. He cannot be treated like a slave. He, uh, within the bounds of good taste, he must be treated as an extension of myself. Understood, Schultz. Bettina Sugar? Yes, sir. Django isn't a slave. Django is a free man, you understand? You can't treat him like any of the other niggas around here because he ain't like any of the other niggas around here. You got it? You want I should treat him like white folks? No. That's not what I said. Then I don't know what you want, big daddy. Yes, I can see that. Uh... What's the name of that Pecklewood boy from town that works with the glass? Uh, uh, his mama work over at the lumber yard. Oh, you mean Jerry? That's the boy named Jerry. You know Jerry, don't you, sugar? Yes, I'm big daddy. Well, that's it then. You just treat him like you would Jerry. See that? You see that? You free as long as we allow you to be free. As much as we say you can do, but you ain't free. We're just treating you like we would that, uh, what's that pick of wood boy name down the street? You treat him like you would Jerry, that's right. So, you ain't free, but we gonna treat you like the, the, the so-called garbage that, that come from us that we don't, that we don't claim is what we gonna do. You know, the ones that don't know that they were supposed to be uh, living wealthily and that they on their blessing. You know, cause there is Esau and Edomite that don't know that they on their blessing because you got these Rothschilds living it up on y'all money. Just let y'all know, they living up on y'all money. But see, when we get the kingdom, that shit ain't happening. We all gonna be, there ain't no There's more white homeless people that I have to help out than there is black folk. There's, there's more white homeless people that I have to help out. I don't have to do nothing, but I do anyway. You know what I mean? Then there is black folk. So called black folk. Ignorant like folk. You know? And even then, some of y'all niggas are gonna break. Like, I'm hungry. So you wanna get you to McDonald's? Hell no, I want the money. <laughs> and bitch, I want my money too. So that's a job. You know? But hey, sometimes people need fucking help. You know, I need help. You know, I need help. You know, I got help to get this job. Or well, by asking, that's helpful. You know? But they're cool. You know, so far, they actually need some, some uh, ex Mormon people. And it's funny because they understand what I'm talking about. I think I believe they go back to, well, I know the girl, they're like a step family, or so a family, you know, marriage and shit. And I know the girl, she said, her actually, they she blonde hair and everything, but she's like, my bloodline go back to this shit. So, because the Mormons actually, they do that shit. They trace that shit. They do that whole genealogy thing. She was like, yeah. 
right now, I go back to Easton. Like, oh, all right. But the spirit of uh, the Most High still ain't up on them, you know, like everybody. But I, I get it. You know, there's gonna be people that wake up later on. And when I say later on, I'm talking about right now. Like y'all think when I say later on, I'm y'all think I'm talking about a couple years from now. We don't have no couple years from now. There ain't no fucking couple years from now. I'll be surprised if we make it in the next year. But the way the weather patterns and everything is in, I will be fucking surprised if we make it into next year. Fucking surprised. The way the wars and shit is packing up, I'll be fucking surprised. You got 20 of those, what them niggas is called, them Arabs or whatever. I don't know what groups. They were either Arabs. I don't like calling them that though. Like Ishmael is getting killed by the Moabites. I just say that so y'all fucking understand. The Indians, the Indians, the Arabs, whatever, so y'all beginning for people could understand, you know? Because people forget sometimes beginner people listen to this shit, you know? But yeah, man. Y'all better start fucking realizing there ain't gonna be that much more time. We going, hey man, the prophecies is speaking. You know, he said, throw it on Terry, wait for it. I know y'all like, oh, he ain't pulling up fucking, fucking, uh, verses. Nigga, I'm telling you the verses. If I mess them up a little bit, it's apologize, nigga, I'm driving. If you don't believe me, look up the shit. Throw it on Terry, wait for it. Oh, buddy, throw it on Terry, wait for it, K -B KJV. Simple as fuck. You know? But yeah, man. It's coming to a time. Yo, I, I, hey, you got these people online talking about they from the future and shit. <laughs> I'll be laughing my ass off. Like, you from the fucking future? Alright. Yeah. They, they be talking about there's a big war coming. Yeah. But everything they, they, they got looks like super fucking. Oh. Looks like it. Looks like the picture they got. Look like super fucking like high tech shit, you know. But if that's the case. If it's not high tech, it's because we sell, or it's because uh, Israel, because he, he saw it down and he's supposed to charge. This shit, nah, fuck that. You think we on last, man? Fuck that. Yo. If we got to go all the way into the future and nothing happens, fuck that. I know I'm not the only one that's saying that shit, too. Like, man, fuck that. I ain't trying to be here that much fucking long. Not like this in this fucking condition. Fuck that. The way you women act, fuck that. All these lies and bullshit, fuck that, man. Everybody's like, no, I can't wait to get back to work doing this regular ass shit. Like, man, fuck that. I'm trying to be in ruling shit. I'm trying to leave. He says he going to speed up the time for the right sake because this shit, the nigga, we sign and crying. Nigga, I can't make it no 20 more years. I don't want my kids, I need to 
That's why he says not to get a wife in this place or no kids or have no kids because this shit is ridiculous. Fucking ridiculous, man. You can't even turn on news and like, fuck Black Lives Matter and all. Like, I say fuck Black Lives Matter. I mean that shit though. But I don't mean it because they're black. I'm not saying fuck black people. I'm saying fuck anything. Y'all took Black Lives Matter and they took it into some LGBT shit. And it's like, yo, you got made it to feminist ass bullshit. What the fuck happened to the life? You know? Y'all talking about all oh, Black Lives Matter? No, they fucking don't. All lives don't fucking matter. All lives matter. Okay, then why the fuck you killing dogs? All lives matter. Then why the fuck you having abortions? All lives matter. Then why you taking the, the, the Plan B pill? All lives matter. Bitch, then why you ain't staying with your husband? So you affecting his life. All lives matter, but you go and take all of his money from the court. Get the fuck out of here with that bullshit. Black lives don't matter. It ain't even black lives. It needs to be the men's life matter. Black men. It's the black, so-called Israelite men, which are not black or brown. Stop calling that black shit. If, they're men, if the men's life don't fucking matter, then the rest of your fucking life don't matter. You can't reproduce without the men. Go reproduce. You want to go, go reproduce with Esau? Y'all go do that shit. All you fucking women go do that shit. Go create Esau, baby, man. We don't give a fuck. We said we're going to lose our lives for his name's sake. So if you go, your ass you don't want to get in order, then you got to go. You want to fuck up and drive or something? Get the fuck away from me. I think he's going to drive right next to the ship, right? <laughs> right? Get the fuck away from me. Go drive tomorrow. I'm going to fuck up. I'm going to fuck up way. Speed the fuck up or slow the fuck down. Get the fuck away from me. Too bad. I'm going to drive right next to you. Like, hey, what the fuck is wrong with you? It's all over the road, bitch. Why you want to be right next to me? Get the fuck away from me. The same way I feel about y'all, nigga. Like, y'all two thirds, y'all, y'all. Not even, not, I'm not gonna say Israelites that or in the truth. Even if you ain't got the full, bro, nobody has the full truth. But, like, even to be able to sit down and discuss with y'all is way better than talking to some dudes in their ass. You know what I mean? I'll, I'll discuss, I'll just sit there and I'll talk about the Bible with some fucking, but some niggas that come out and knock on the door, y'all are witnesses. They don't know shit's in the Bible, you show them, they'll take it for granted. It's the what it is. Most of them will, I'm pretty sure there's some wicked ass ones. See, that's what the fuck I'm talking about right there. Yeah, stupid ass semi niggas driving like that. How the fuck you gonna drive within five feet of that car and then step on your brakes? You fucking retarded, man. This, this is why this motherfucker place needs to be destroyed because you got bitch ass people driving like this. And you wonder why niggas keep dying and shit because you got fucking retards right here. It don't matter. Every time I fucking turn around, it's a retarded ass nigga doing some retarded ass shit. Either a fucking female, because you ain't no woman just because you got a vagina. Or some fucking male, because you ain't no man just because you got a dick. You are doing some retarded ass shit, man. Retarded, man. Every time I turn around. I just got my fair share of stupid ass shit, retarded shit. I ain't saying I'm fucking innocent. Damn. How the fuck y'all niggas? Why the fuck do y'all niggas ain't waking the fuck up? I mean, y'all starting to, but it's like, you still got niggas as dumb as fuck. Like, nigga, it says wait up on the Lord. Y'all niggas got your stimulus check. Like, I gotta go give me the best Lexus. I gotta go on the shopping street. We telling you the economy is fucked up. We telling you the world's fucked up. Why is he worried about your own salvation? Because we ain't worried about you. Then you're going to be a slave in the kingdom of fucking end. That's why. Because you're a fucking two-thirds. But you still going to be uh, you still be working. You're going to live your best life. I mean, it's going to be a best life if there's an issue. But it's going to be better. It's going to be better, man. I'm fucking hoping. I want to be a hopeful 144. No, bitch, you have faith. Hope means something else. Faith means something totally different. You have faith. You don't fucking hope. Faith. Okay? They're not calling a fucking hope either. They call it faith either. Why? Because faith is honesty. Hope is not honesty. Hope seems like 
Nigga, that's that's some sin and shit. He says that the hundred, the hundred forty-four thousand is gonna be without. They're gonna be blameless. Okay, they're gonna be blameless. All right. I head back to truck up. Shalom. I'm just gonna end this right here. Shalom.